Multi flag CTF. What's up, guys? It's your boy Farwell back with another gameplay and commentary. This time we're doing Shrine CTF, and this is more of an in my head how to play uh, a game commentary. It's been a while since I've done a commentary. But here we go, the timer in the bottom right hand corner is to represent how long it takes us to get the first cap. As you see we grab rockets off spawn and they're four dead already. I'm looking for the spawner and I, and I see rocks and as soon as I have the sniper rifle it's exceptionally easy to get the spawners on rocks. So as you see there, pick off two players, switch to my BR and also the fourth player is dead. There you go, four down and we can start to move the flag more to our base. We've already got it on our side. And it actually turns out we capped the first flag on Shrine in 46 seconds, I think. It's going to come up right about now. And you can see there, 46.113 seconds it took us. And they've already got a player quit. He's had enough. He's gone. He realises we're too good, too strong, too strong. And they're spawning turret this time. Now, what I would like to talk about uh, with Shrine flag is you want to, I wouldn't say spawn trap, but you want to pin the enemy back. And the way you do this is you have one on Carbine. Their carbine where I was standing just then. You want one on their pea shooter, which is the walkway between sniper, the sniper and the ring two. And you want someone on ring three, like I'm doing there. And I drop down to a ring uh, ring two right now. But if you have some two people in ring and one on the each of the main other points, the carbine and the uh, pea shooter, you, have, you can have a good time. I mean, you can see here that guy who went courtyard didn't actually stand a chance. He, um, he didn't die, but he, at the same time, I managed to put in one shot, and it was enough to deter him from coming back. Now, the reason why you want someone at, uh, in these locations is, the, the three spawns on this map, well, four, I guess you could say, are rocks, turret, flag, and under sniper, or in snipe hut. And, um, if you have someone on carbine, and ring two, uh, ring two or three, uh, you can see Rock spawn easily, as you saw at the start of the game, and now, as I pick off the guy off the spawner from Rocks, it's really easy to snipe uh, it to Rocks. It, rocks is really open spawn. Turret, you got it covered. And as long as you have good team communication, which you do in the competitive playlist, this is HCS, bear in mind, the competitive playlist, um, you need team communication. Without communication, you're not gonna, you're not gonna do well. But with communication, you can call out where they're spawning, and effectively pick them off. Anyway guys, um, that's really all I have to say, just control those positions and you're going to have a really good time and I just really wanted to showcase uh, how quick we got these flags because it's, it's something of a rarity for, uh, for me personally and I think just in general uh, to have these really really quick um, flag victories, especially on Shrine where the map is so big and it's basically dominated by the sniper and rockets. Anyway guys, that's all from me. There's the last flag cap. Like, subscribe, Twitter and Twitch, and I'll catch you guys all next time. Peace out.